It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. So my roommate left a note for me. And, you know, I tell you, living with Kathy is like living with a teenager sometimes. And, for example, uh, let's see if we can look at the note here that I have. That probably focused in pretty well. And, uh, as you can see, she actually wrote down OMG, not OMD. OMD would be pretty cool. I mean, you know, she could, like, make references, you know, like, to their song titles, and, you know, that would, it, would, it would just be great. Well, if she said she was so in love with me, that would be kind of creepy, but you get the idea. So, so anyway, so you're thinking, okay, well, today's generation, you know, writing LOL and OMG and whatever, you know, it's believable. She's 47. I really think that the internet has brought out a certain personality out of certain people. And it's not so much that the younger generation is more likely to use phrases such as OMG and LOL, but because they haven't been around as long and their character hasn't been developed as much, they're more susceptible for letting these influences take them over, which, you know, goes with the whole theory of kids are more impressionable than adults. I think that to varying degrees, we all have the ability to use stupid acronyms when we're writing notes. I just think that it's more prevalent in children because they've got less to compare it to, so it f doesn't feel as weird to them. So, I mean, I'm sure there's plenty of kids who are LOLing their way through the day, just like there's plenty of adults who, even if they were younger, wouldn't. So, I think when people shake their fists and say, these kids, what they're really saying is, these undeveloped, lack of character people is what they're really saying. Now, I wouldn't say my roommate has no character. She's quite a character. I just think that she, for whatever reason, is just, just predisposed to using such terminology. Some people just like certain phrases more than others. That's just how it works. So, like, that doesn't even faze me. And I don't think it ever would have. But I know a lot of people would be like, whoa, hang on, OMG, man. She said OMG in a note. That's all the time we have for today. Visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.